Ooh. Oh mate, it's looking like a dead quiet one today, isn't it? Yeah, sure is, mate. Hello. I don't know what I'm looking at. This might be a, a washout. <clears throat> How much are your shoes? Men's eight. <laughs> I'll just take one pair, please. I've got to buy some. It's looking a bit dry today, isn't it? <laughs> okay. Thank you. Lovely. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Um, oh, sorry. After you, mate. No, 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 no. I might, I might be able to buy something else. Here. Let's yeah. have a look. What sort of size? These are all uh, XL. Oh, thank you, thank you. How much are you asking for them? Don't know yet. <laughs> yeah. yeah fair. There we go. Thank you for that. That's okay. uh, maybe this, maybe this blue polo one. Well, uh, yeah, a couple of quid. Some more sort of sauce. I think so. I'm trying Sweet to. Sweet as. Thank you, mate. I appreciate it. Thank you, mate. Thank you. How much? Sold. <laughs> I'm not going to tell her either. I'm just going to put it on the door. <laughs> Thank you. It's going to pick off at me all day round now, isn't it? How much are your teddy bears in here? Um, How much? Yeah. The crocodile or dinosaur? Um, two, yeah. Told. I appreciate it, thank you. No worries. I know you're everywhere, aren't you? Got a little uh, leaflet in, in there. Mm, don't know. I'm not sure. Let's have a look at that one. No, I wouldn't have thought. I don't know. Maybe if they're cheap enough, it's worth a, worth a bash, isn't it? Yeah, right, I've come the wrong side. I'm behind the counter at Tesco's. Is what I am. You want to hang up clothes? You crap on. <laughs> you, got any, you got any men's in there? No. I'm not interested then. No. Oh, sorry. Um, where am I going? How much is your DVD set? Ten quid for that one. Yeah. Have a look at this cow with us. Plenty of cows to choose from. Yeah, I saw, yeah. Mean glasses, isn't it? Second lap. The Scar Money Box, which you can see on here, was 20. You can have that. Five English pounds. Thank you very much. Right. We haven't got a bag of them. No, right? no, I don't want a bag. Not these days that they charge us for them. How much are the pencils? How much are the pencils, Shirley? Yeah. Uh, what do you reckon? What about Biffy? Three quid. Three quid. What about Biffy? Three quid. Three quid. To Three you. Quid. Unopened. Would you do two on them? Two fifty. Sold. Sold, sold, sold. Sold. Lovely. We always liked you. <laughs> you liar. You did. And if not, I have got some more 50s here. Oh, the lovely parasol. Here you go. Thank you very much. Have a lovely day. You too. Oh, the lovely parasol. Shut up. So small, I think I'm, I think I'm on my third lap today. <laughs> Beautiful. Oh, what a day today. You got anywhere else today? Is this it? Yeah, fair play. Batcham. Batcham car boot sale after this. Yeah, I've done two now already. Three a day is my, is my fix, you see. All right, mate. All right, mate. Yeah, tinier today, isn't it? It's all right, yeah. It, it'll be bigger than this today, which is weird, because this one's normally like 
the second biggest out of the two, do you know what I mean? Yeah. We was going to go to Way Hill, but we left a bit there. Which one's Way Hill? A3? Near, Am near Andover. Oh, yeah, yeah. Pickett's near there. Was it? Or... Past, just outside the other side Is of Andover. It? It's quite big, actually. It's probably bigger than this one. How much are you asking for these? Five for a bag out for for too much weight. Behave, man. You're about my size, ain't you? <laughs> Well, these XL, aren't they? Or large? Double XL, that one. Yeah, I'll get a tenner on them. I think. Keep one, sell one, I think. Get it for free. Thank you, mate. I appreciate it. Chubby and Jethro. Someone's got a bit of taste. Is it you? Yeah. Bit of shit, though, isn't it? I like it when somebody says it's more interest you. See you next barber. <laughs> I used to collect those, believe it or not. I had like an really? obsession with them because of what I was doing. And I went to sell them all after. Well, how cool are they? Some are. But yeah. A monkey. Hello. Bless you. Thank you. How much are the little wind ups? Do they wind up still? Well, I assume they do. I haven't done it for so long. I'll risk it. I'll take a chance. There you go. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. You're right, my Hello, mate. How are you? Good, good. Yeah, I left you a minute ago. I saw you get. I saw you getting swamped. So I was like, okay, I'll wait for you. Just that five minutes to get it out. That's all you need in it. Five minutes. Oh, I'm done. See you later. Have a good one. Not a very big car boot cell, but it gives me plenty of time to run to the other one, which is 45 minutes away, so I need to try and get there ASAP. Well, 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 as is the only way to be, we cannot be ungrateful. We've had the opportunity to go out and find some stuff. My legs are working, my hands are working, had a bit of cash in the pocket, and I was able to go and have a go at least. So we've got to be grateful. Although the car boot sale was not very fruitful, again, but it is drawing to the end of the season. Let's just dive straight into it. Paid £2.50 for these Conte colouring pencils. Oh my goodness, the glare. It's a good little brand to look out for if you can. These only sell for about £12 to £15, if that. But for £2.50, we're not complaining. £3 paid on these funky looking Converse. They're almost like clear and see-through, but lime greenish. Does that make sense? A little bit of cracking on the back there where they've been sat for a while, but you know, a few marks. I don't know if the marks are even possible to get out, I guess. But inside, they look like they've been barely been worn. Maybe worn a couple of times and then just chucked in the backs of cupboards. Do you know what I mean? I picked them up because they were different. Three pounds paid. I don't know, 12, 15. Polo, Ralph Lauren, Pima Soft Touch. I think it's a Pima or a Pima? Probably Pima. Pima Soft Touch. Maybe it's Pima. I don't know, who cares? Two pounds from the same people, nice big XL size, probably 12 to 15 pound on that one. A couple of Berghaus, like soft shell, soft fleece tops. Both, that, this one's a half zip with a nice pocket on there. A nice size, what's this one? Double XL, I think it was. Double XL on that one. And then this one is a bit lighter and lighter in color. Again, double XL, soft touch, some nice shelling down the sides. There are five of each, £10 for the pair. I said to him, I'll probably sell one and keep one. Which colour do I prefer? I think darker. Maybe I could wear one arm here and one arm there. These are very cool and they do work as well. 1997 Cartman and Kenny wind up walking figures. Really, really nice. They're, they're made out of that vinyl. Let's see if I can show you on the camera them working. There you go. Race. One pound each. Don't know about value. I've got a chap who loves South Park. He might spot these. If you're watching the video, mate, reach out quickly before I list them. And I can offer them to you first. And then this, because Halloween's coming around the corner soon, and I'm tempted to try and scare Ada. Is that her now? She's not with a banana. 
Oh shit, it's not working. I think it was a pound or two pound. I don't think it's gear me or anything like that. I don't know who it's made by, probably just some um, cheap thing. But Halloween's coming up, I want to hang it on the door. And then for two pound, is it called the Doppy Dino Stegosaurus Jelly Cat? So I need to reach out to. So whoever it is that's collecting jelly cats, reach out to me. Be quick because they do go fast. Two pound paid for that. I'm not too sure. Maybe 15, 25. I haven't done any research just yet. Nice. So I spent 22 pound. That is it. I'll get that back on probably just one of the burger house, to be honest. So my money's safe. I've got my money back plus plenty of profit. And I can't take for granted the fact that I had the opportunity to even go out there and try and find some stuff. I've got loads here that's unlisted, loads of stuff that I need to get sorted out and get online. I'm not worried about stock. I like to go out there for the interactions, the excitement, the thrill of the hunt, and obviously add to my stockpile. Not death pile, stockpile. So I need to be grateful for the fact that I even had that opportunity. As long as I'm not losing, I'm winning. Thank you so much for watching, really appreciate it. And I'll see you on the next one, which is gonna be very soon, I'm sure.